na o na 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 o na 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 viva ganacho viva ganacho running down their wings here united sing viva ganacho viva ganacho viva ganacho running down their wings here united sing viva ganacho Tony Marshall, he came from France. The English press said he had no chance. 50 million down the drain. Tony Marshall scores again. Bruno, Bruno, Bruno. He's a Portuguese magnifico. Well, 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 y'all know what time it is. Welcome to United Public Square. I can go on and on and on with these chants but the matter of fact is that manchester united has won three goals to zero at goodison park i made a bold prediction in my stream the other day i said united is gonna win by two goals to zero and i think they overhead me and they were like we can do one better so um everton zero manchester united three this is a very very complete football performance and i think this is our best performance all season long I'm not, I'm not going to be sitting here and overanalyzing the game. Today, we are just in a celebratory mode, right? We haven't won by three goal margin in a very long time. In fact, this season, we haven't won by more than one goal margin, right? So this is a very, very good performance, a very good win, and a very good, good three goal margin. Lots of positives to take away from this game. Um, like I said, this is a very complete soccer performance. I'm going to touch on um, Onana, Andre Onana. With a clean sheet, um, we we know there uh, we know the amount of mistakes he's been making throughout the season. But this time around, he kept a clean sheet at Goodison Park. So I'm gonna say really, really very good uh, performance. He pulled out like three good saves in this game, and I'm very proud of um, Onana's performance. And then came the overhead kick stunner from Viva Ganacho. What a magnificent goal. I think this goal is going to be contesting for the goal of the season. We, um, this goal is being compared side by side by Rooney's goal against Manchester City. The same style overhead kick. But people already are saying that uh, Ganacho's goal is a tad better than uh, Rooney's goal. So goal of the season performance. What a very, very good goal. Um, look at this. This young teenage boy giving us a magnificent opener at Goodison Park. Uh, you cannot top that. So we are so impressed and very, very proud of of this goal as United fans. And then came the second goal, um, the penalty kick by uh, Marcus Rashford to make it 2-0. And Bruno's exemplary leadership performance style by handing the ball over to Marcus Rashford to take the penalty kick was so, so um, heartwarming, right? Bruno felt like I need to give a boost to Rashford who's been low on confidence, hasn't scored a lot of goals. And then um, he gave the ball to him and Rashford is a good penalty taker. So he converted the second goal with that penalty kick, and then um, we were two, uh, and, and then we were up to zero. What a way to silence the Everton fans, right? At this point, they are thinking, they sat there thinking, like, what is happening here? They couldn't even believe their own eyes, and they, you know, they came in with a siege mentality. They were protesting the Premier League. They had signs of fraud and all that fraud to the Premier League. They were accusing the Premier League of fraud with their with their ten point deduction. They had these signs up in the stadium, and it was like very hostile. But at this minute, we are already two goals ahead and they were like really um, mesmerized <laughs> sitting there and thinking, what is happening to our team? Um, United is not part of this. We just did our thing. And like in the press, in the press conference and in my, in my previous video, I mentioned the fact that we need to quiet these fans. And boy, did we quiet um, Everton fans. It was really, really, really hostile. Even when they were down by two goals, they, st they still kept coming. And they were like really noisy, but uh, we kept our cool. We never really agitated the fans any worse than we could with our two goals. And we we're just cruising at this moment. And then came Tony Marshall's goal in the 75th minute with that cool and collected chip over Pickford. That was a sight to behold. And at this point, it's already 3-0. It's game over. And then the rest is just a formality. See out the game. Make sure you do not concede any goals. Give Onana his clean sheet that he deserves. And that's exactly what we did. Really, really great and an excellent team performance. This is a real boost as we roll on to the next one against Galatasaray in the Champions League, right? That game is a win or bust situation. If we do not win that game, we are out of the Champions League. And so I'm praying and hoping that we take a lot, a lot. I mean, a lot of 
morale and vim from this game that we just won. So now I'm sat here thinking and hoping and praying that we take all the positives, the good vibes and the vim we got from this Everton game into the Champions League on Wednesday with all our might and face Galatasaray in that game. It's a really, really crucial game. I do not hope our Champions League journey ends at Galatasaray on Wednesday. So I'm praying and hoping that Manchester United show up and win that game as well. Tonight, though, all Manchester United fans are on a high, and we wish the boys good luck for Wednesday. Glory, glory, Man United. Please like, share, and subscribe to this video as well, and let me know your thoughts in the comment section. See you on the next one. Peace.